Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Suikoden 3. Alright, let's uh, head to through Kaput Forest and uh, to Al McKinnon. So, yeah, there's a there's an exit off the uh, the map here. I wonder where which uh, path that could be through, huh? Hmm. Couldn't possibly be that one that we uh, kept getting teleported back in before, could it? Nah, couldn't be. Rabbit rabbits, huh? Can I? Nope. All right, just auto. Bad bunnies, bad. Love that damage. Whee! Ooh, nice damage, Yumi. No, not that one. I'll do, do some healing shortly. Here's where the protective barrier begins. Don't wander off or you'll be stuck in the forest. Protective barrier? Is it some kind of magic? Could be. Some call it that. Okay, let's go! Wait, um, Fred, you're, you're not the leader of this group. We didn't invite him, did we? It doesn't matter. We haven't had guests for ages. What is it? Get moving! Uh, Fred. Fred, get your butt back here. I'm the leader here. Uh, let's see... Nope, don't need it. Thanks, Bartz. I appreciate your, uh, your supportability. A force field starts here. Does it? Really? I don't see anything. A force field? I don't see anything. Hey, hey I read her mind. This is it. Usually you return to where you started from. Its power is weakened lately, though. Hmm, that doesn't sound good. Yeah, our screen isn't getting foggy. Hi, monster's gonna let you go. Dang it. You know what? Try it. Yeah. <laughs> good. I hate fighting those things. Leave me alone, stupid beetles. No one likes you. Yay, new area! Not gonna be able to say that too many more times in this game, really. It's a fairly limited air. Fair, uh, the areas in this game are fairly limited, but uh, I mean, I do like that. I don't really get too tired of going through old areas that much. Uh, are we good? Are we good? We're good. Oh, hey! You eerie! We are home! Hi, Yun. Good to see you back. By the way, did you find her? Yes, this is Chris, you eerie. She helped us defend the Chisha village, too. Nice to meet you, Chris. I am you eerie. I am in charge of the village. Welcome to Al McKinnon. My pleasure. I am Chris, but would someone be kind enough to tell me what's going on? Surely, my dear. But that would take longer than I have at the moment. I'm preparing for one of our rituals. Would tonight be soon enough? Most assuredly. Totally need more female voices. I will come too. Who's that? Ah, oh, crap. I see at least one of you is perceptive and on the ball. I'm not sure if they've met before. I make a good spy. Um, why are we letting her, uh, letting him in to our group? You, you are not human. 
What am I then? Actually, I'm glad I'm not as fragile a course as humans are. How did you get past the force field into our sacred Almakin, and what do you want? I sense something amiss. A disturbance in the space continuum. I figured someone was using an invisible force field. All I had to do was find a weak spot in the barrier, and voila! Here I am. But let's get down to business. To fight a, a war? But I know that there just happens to be another true water rune seal here. Could you explain this to me? Who told you? Even the dead reveal their secrets to me. Monster. Yeah, he is at that. Oh, seriously, he, he's like surrounded now. Yuri has joined. We've got the Alma Kinnon, uh, um combo. She's a little bit higher level. I don't know if she has any runes equipped, but uh, uh, they're both uh, ranged users, so... You know, I might... I think I'll put them in the middle. Um, that might be a little bit better. Alright, there we go. Alright, another fight with Uber. Totally going to Phoenix in. Uh, let's see. Damage foes once per battle. I think that hits everyone, so I'm not sure that that's really necessary. Um, she has a killer rune. She has wind. Funeral wind. Well, that does more damage. Uh, but that looks like it would go right to the next one. So what about Mother Earth? Earthquake. Excellent. And Maximilian. Yeah, you're casting. Uh, hopefully this will end your casting. Oh yeah. Very nice. Dope. Good. All right. One damage. That's less than good. 870 damage. I oh he is he is almost down now. And he did not get a chance to do anything. Mother Earth, Earthquake, again, definitely doing that. Okay, we can't combo, so let's just attack. Ooh. Nice Nash! All right, well, um, I, I think having that double strike rune and the phoenix rune on Chris kind of made this battle easy. <laughs> it is supposed to be harder than that. It is definitely supposed to be harder than that. You cheating worms! Who told you you could have those two runes? No matter. I know where this village is now. Things will be different next time. Hey, get your butt back here. Who or what was that? Tell me. One of the destructive forces that Yun was talking about. Destructive forces? Yes, I will explain this to you too later. Yun and Yumi, show them around the village. I will be at Great Auntie's. And Yuri has left. Dang it! Uh, so yeah, that was, uh, that was a smidgen easier than I expected. Just, just, just a skosh. Just, just tad. Alright, I'm a kid in village. Hey guys, we just took out Uber in two, t two rounds. Yeah, yeah, pretty awesome, huh? Ah, nice foresty village. I like foresty villages. Enter and look around. I doubt if there's much that will catch your eye here. Oh, you've got shops. There certainly will be. You have, uh, um, the rarity sections. I saw a flashy-looking couple when I was hunting this morning. I didn't speak with them, but they seemed to be in training. Hmm. That donkey won't budge. 
So when I harvest things in the forest, I use this one, and then put herb bandages on it. Duck! How did you get here, duck? I was just out picking herbs, but now where am I? I got this as a present. Do you want it? Except orange kennel. Sure, thank you. I've never seen a duck before. His tummy feathers look so soft and squishy. Think you would mind if I rubbed it? Probably not. This area is great for mountain vegetables and fruit. While the forest lives, there's no need to develop the land. Beyond this point is the most sacred ground in the village, so keep your hands to yourself. Okay. Mm, nice music, too. Hello! Our inn serves the best cake. We haven't had a guest in ages. Won't you have some cake in honor of the occasion? Except recipe number 10, sure. Thank you. Wait, I went through a door. How am I upstairs? My first customer in ages! I've la laid out a brand new fur just for him. I hope he doesn't realize it's his donkey. Oh. What? What the hell was that? That's... that's frightening. How nice to see you! I expect the forest path seemed very long. Have a seat and rest your legs. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, stay. We'll get that spell back that we used up. Go ahead and save it again. I can't believe how easy na uh, uh, Uber was in that battle. Oh, double strike in Phoenix is so good. Please come again. Yeah, well, let's see what else we have over here. A monster bit my horse in the leg when we were hunting. Do you think that's a bad sign? I don't know. It'd probably be worse if a moose bit it. It may be a battle. I was told not to go outside, but I want to practice hunting. I hid my treasure in an urn, and now I can't find it. But I found this instead. Except melon seeds. Why, thank you. Can we find them? Can we find your treasure? Oops. Hmm, which urn was it? Oop. I'm not sure if can find whatever it is that she's talking about. I will try looking. No, it doesn't look like it. Dang it, illusionary doors! Or false doors. Good day to you. Would you care for some medicine to scratch that itch that you just can't reach? I'm pretty sure I can reach that itch. And you have no, you have no rarity section. I'm disappointed. Um, pretty sure, yeah, you can get a killer rune from that. I want that. I want your killer runes. You're such a lazy ass. This donkey sure eats a lot. <laughs> lazy ass. I'm a student shaman. I'm studying here. Why don't you learn something, too, while you're here? Alright, so, uh, this place is a little bit unusual in that it has both a, uh, um, bujutsu teacher and a, uh... I didn't even know there was a person back here. I don't make weapons of war right now. The ones are, these ones are mostly for hunting. Well, surely you can use them for war. So it has both a bujutsu teacher and a, uh, um, education center. So many skills are born in the forest of Al McKinnon. If you need skills, I can teach you. Why, thank you. Uh, do, do, do. Go there. Um, let's go for accuracy. So that's about all that I can get with him right now. Thank you. Uh, Yumi. 
then maybe I should have gone for accuracy. I don't know. Uh, no, we'll get that up to B. I can get that up to B plus, actually. Let's do that. And what can you actually... What are you good at? Swing, damage, and holy dash. Okay. Swing and damage are definites. Um... I don't have a whole lot of points. Let's go with Shield Protect, since that's fairly cheap. And I think I could do Armor Protect. Yes, we'll do that. Get those both up to B. And Rico, Fighting Spirit helps repel foes' stun and unbalance attacks. Not all that great. Um, the only things that I've seen so far that use those are like the boars. Can't do that anymore. Okay. What else can you learn? Uh, armor Protect. I probably want to do Armor Protect at some point. Actually... Let's do that right now. Alright. I don't think there's a whole lot else that we're going to do. I don't think we have any more points. Yeah, and the only thing that I can get up on her is magic rationing. What other magics are you good at? Uh, water, lightning, and magic resistance. I think we're good for now. Uh, actually, do we have any more rune slots? Nope. other buildings over here to look at. I can talk to you, I believe. There's no one over here. Check the urns, check the urns. Oh. People speak of omens of war. I'd like to bear a rune for the sake of the village, but what rune would be best? Lightning. Hello there. If it's rune power you need, don't hesitate to drop by. Well, all I have is that. What do you have for sale? Fire, lightning, water, earth, wind. You can get a jongler rune? Yumi can buy? It can wear a jongler rune? I didn't know you could buy these. Ah, I might have to double check to see if uh, Sergeant Joe can actually use that. Um... No one has any slots right now, so... Nope. Can we go upstairs? Darn your false doors! Darn you! Oh. This is where our great aunt lives. Yuri should be waiting for us. I've been wondering. I haven't seen a single man in this village. Why is that? Have they all gone to battle? This is a village of Alma Kinnon. The shaman clan of the Grasslands lives here. We are all women. <laughs> Fred is so happy. This is an all-woman clan? Nash is really happy. Odd custom, I'd say. You think so? This is how we have lived for a long time. I'd like to know why. It's better not to know. I will be inside. Join me when you are done with the tour. I think we're kind of done with the tour right now. Why on earth are we here? Yuna has left your part. Yep. I don't think we can go this way, really. I suppose we can. It's letting me, so... Okay. I hear the Duck Clan has plenty of water, and it's really lively. Does that mean they have lots of water bottles? What? Also, kitty! Alright, not much going on back here.
All right, well, we're pretty much done with the tour. Um, I guess we'll go see uh, Yun and Yuri. Please come in. Make yourselves at home. After all, you are our guests. We seldom entertain around here. I can see that. The village seems like it's rejecting the outside world. You are quite outspoken. I'm sorry. I'm used to saying what's on my mind. Helps to be in command when you do that. You aren't totally wrong. We are very committed to our duties, and sometimes this does require us to withdraw from the outside world. Interesting. Then please, tell me why we're here. About the destructive force we just encountered. The water rune seal that he mentioned, and about the flame champion. Yun. Chris, I am a child of the Alma Kinnon with an unusual gift that sometimes allows me to see into the future. You're like a fortune teller? Who said you could talk? You can think of it that way, if that helps you. There's one vision that has haunted me since my birth. This is the destruction of the true rune, and the resurrection of the flame champion. The destruction of the true rune? Is that even possible? Yes, the power of the twenty-seven true runes which sustain the world. There are people who seek to destroy one of the runes. The man in black whom we just encountered is probably one of them. What happens if a true rune is destroyed? Why are they so determined? A long time ago there was a hero in the grasslands, the flame champion Ald. It wasn't that long ago. We, the people of Alma Kinnon, joined the battle under his leadership against the Harmonian army. During the second major battle, the flame champion Ald and his followers, the Firebringer, were surrounded by the Harmonian forces. Oh crap. Are we going to get a flashback? Did I forget to change a setting or something? I don't know. Where is the flame champion? Where is Ald? I don't know. I expected to have a screwed up flashback sequence. Damn, if this continues, we're all finished. What's that? S something? The Firebringer, the Harmonian forces, and the Grassland troops were all engulfed in a firestorm and perished. They say the fire burned for ten days. The only survivor was the Flame Champion himself. He did not speak of it, but the force behind it was the power of the true rune. It must have been a rune a rune of it must have been a rune power out of control. Ald repented for this horrible deed which took many lives of both ally and foe. The true rune power out of control? If the true rune was destroyed, everyone could perish. From the grasslands to Zexen, Holy Harmonia to Dragonia, to the south and northern outlands. Tinto would probably be fine, though. That's nonsense. Why do you say that? Just think about it. What is the purpose of doing this? There's nothing to, nothing to gain. It sounds like a fantasy to me. Then you don't believe me. Zex and knights don't fight for fantasy. We're bound by loyalty and reason. Sorry, could you leave me alone for a while? I need to think. And we're alone. Um, I'm not exactly sure where we're supposed to go and think, but... Uh, it's getting close to the end of the episode, so I think we'll go save, and uh, in the next episode we will figure out what we're supposed to do. Hello. Yep. I'm going to go ahead and save. So, in the next episode, uh, I'll probably go talk to Nash and see what's up. See you then.